What's up, everybody? It's the homie Truth Teller, the street reporter, and I got some exclusive news I want to share with you guys. Reports is coming out of Chicago uh, from a few blog sites and actually from Lil J, uh cousin, I believe, Rockstar Harry J, good dude, very talented artist. I actually had a chance to interview him a little while ago. Uh, he hopped on IG Live and said that it's official. Lil J officially got that murder case dropped off of him. So, uh, according to Rockstar Harry J, Lil J not facing a murder case no more. They dropped the murder case. He just facing, I believe, an aggravated robbery or something like that, which many people believe he's going to be able to beat that. I'm hearing rumors around that that charge carry up to maybe 10 years. He might be facing up to 10 years or something like that. I'm hearing that he might get somewhere between five to eight if that's possible somebody even said maybe around five they got an already set three years so it's like he got three years of jail time so if it's five years you figure in two years maybe 13 <laughs> to Lil J will be home you get what i'm saying so it's official it looks like Lil J is going to be coming home and coming from up under this now i don't know if it's going to be right now or if he's going to have to serve a year maybe two years <laughs> like Lil J not going to be uh, locked up for four five years it looked like the decision when he turned down those seven years that people were saying that the state offered him a lot of people were saying he was stupid he was dumb but it looked like it paid off it looks like legit his lawyers knew they didn't really have a lot of proof on him and stuff like that one thing i can say is this kind of um if it's true, this kind of throw away the rumors that maybe FBG Butter was telling on Lil J because clearly if FBG Butter was at the crime scene and he say, look, Lil J was there, Lil J did this, Lil J did that, then how in the hell is they going to be able to just throw that shit away and say, hey, the case is dropped on Lil J. So that's kind of crazy there. Yeah, I'm not sure if that was the media making up those rumors or maybe that shit really did go on and just... It wasn't enough proof to prove Lil J. You get what I'm saying? So I'm not saying that didn't happen. I'm just saying when Lil J got locked up, that shit down there destroyed the whole FBG crew. You know, from Duck to Billionaire Black kind of looked like they had beef with Lil J while he was locked up, even though that might not be uh, everything. You know, the passing the FBG brick, uh, the rise of famous Dax not coming back to look for Lil J. So I think it's a lot of unanswered questions. One thing I want to know, and I want to ask from y'all, if Lil J end up coming home, do you think he should come back to Chicago and finish his rap career?